The video you're about to see was uploaded three years ago. It was taken down shortly afterwards. It shows a rescue, a daring rescue. It shows the kind of rescue that everybody would like to do or perform once in their lives. We took it down because at the time mm, it wasn't a good idea to, to have it up. But years have passed. We've made some changes. The rescue of Cora. Enjoy it. Hi, Sergio and I have been traveling for most of the day. We're driving. Uh, we received a terrible video. A dog, a hunting dog, living in horrific conditions. Just please have a look at this video because I will tell you later what it is that you see. ¿Qué pasa, pequeña? Fíjate en las ubres, creo que son ubres. Lo habrán tenido solo para traer camada. Tiene un ojo ciego, ¿no? Tiene como mate o opaco. In this video you see an old female dog. I know it's a female dog because I can see there that she has terrible mammary tumors. This dog lives abandoned in a horrific condition. She's probably surrounded by dirt and her own excrements. And that is no life for a dog. So today we're going to save, solve this case, uh, doing, we're doing that thing we do sometimes, where we go in, we jump over fences, and uh, we run away with the dog. So the dog is alone in a field, right? Pues mira, es, son dos naves que están son independientes una de la otra y la perrita la tenemos cara a un campo agrícola. El espacio sí que es grande, el, el acceso es, es medianamente fácil ¿no? de acceder, incluso con un coche si fuera necesario. She's always alone. Siempre, sí. How long do you think she's been there? Pues yo diría que esta perra lleva ahí años. Tal y como la he visto, no es una perra joven, ya tiene su edad, yo creo que lleva ahí toda la vida. Entonces yo la vi hace, ahora, no te sé decir si cuatro o cinco meses largos, lo descubrí gracias a que mi perro un día la, la vio, la, la olió y me chocó que el perro estuviese ahí. ¿Cómo es ella? ¿Cómo es ella? ¿Es friendly? Es simpática, tiene miedo. ¿Cómo reacciona a la gente? Eh, es cariñosa. Además, eh, el primer encontronazo que tuvimos, ella se acercó a mí el primer día, pero eh, yo diría que o bien está ciega o sorda. Es posible que tenga la leishmaniasis. She could be blind one or two eyes. So, we are gonna go. Which is luck. Got this, uh, ¿Cómo estás? Contesto. ¿Qué tal? You have to treat the animals right. No podéis tratar a los perros tan mal. Siempre vendremos nosotros y nos los llevaremos. ¿A que sí? Tenemos tu puta pesadilla. Muy lejos, ¿sí? No, ya estamos. Víctor, te voy a presentar a, a mi amiga, la pacificadora. La pacificadora. So this is it. This is what is gonna set this baby free. Muy bien. Muy bien. We're getting near. It's half past 12 at night. I don't know what is uh, what is more difficult to do it at night or to do it in the middle of the day, like last time. There's absolutely no one here. Ya está. 
that's it. It's done. One less dog living in hell. We're not gonna be able to save the world, but this one, this one is safe. Now her life is gonna change. Wow, oh my God, such stress. I'm too old for this shit. <laughs> So we just came to the vet, hemos venido al veterinario, echamos comida, vamos a ir a casa, le vamos a pegar un baño, le vamos a quitar todas las pulgas y todo lo que tenga. We're gonna get rid of all these fleas and ticks and everything. <sighs> Poor baby. So, vamos, que guay. Let's go. Vamos a echar. when people don't neuter their dogs and they use them for breeding. She was probably a good hunting dog at some point and they use her for breeding and this is the result. Look at this. Must be thinking this is this is heaven. The water is warm. This is 
espero de que jamás la cepillaran ni nada. Have you seen what we can do to save our lives? Animal rescue is one of the most fulfilling things that one can do with their lives. And sometimes we have to do things guided by our moral compass. You know, even if that means, you know, you know what I mean. Anyway. Guys, hope you enjoyed it. Rescue of Cora. Cora lived with us for for a few months. After that, she was operated. We took the tumors out. Eventually, Cora passed, and but she enjoyed life to the full while she was with us. Thank you very much for being here. Thanks for your support. And as I always say, please uh, help me continue saving lives. Please join me on my support group on Patreon. I really need you there. Take care.